Welcome to Disney How To. In this how to we're going to look at how you can load a Simbri flight plan inside the Airbus A310. So before going inside the aircraft we of course first need to create the flight plan. And that's what we've done here right. So we're flying from uh, Baltimore to Orlando. And then we also have I would say a backup airport if needed. Uh, for, if for some reason the, uh, the other or the destination airport is closed right. Then we still need to have an alternate airport which you can see over here. Uh, Currently, I use the default Airbus A310, uh, let's say, flight model, but there is also a specific one which you can download from the Indie Buildings website. I'll put a link to that one uh, so you can download it from there. So we created the plan and that's all cool. And then you think, okay, hey, but Indie Building, it has built-in SIM brief support. Yes, it has, right? So you can say populate it uh, by going inside uh, your aircraft of course and then let's make it starting so we're gonna do the uh, trick so we're gonna start for the gpu and then you would expect hey i'm gonna go to the uh, menu and dino will go to a cars and then i put in my username which is over here and then i request a uh, sim reef pl flight plan but as you can see, it's remained in stock state. And that's something which you read a lot on the fora from uh, any buildings. So I'm going to show you a workaround to prevent this issue from happening. So how to work around this issue is by installing the any manager. And the any manager can be, I'd say, downloaded from the any building website. And once you are, I'd say, starting it for the first time, it will ask you to provide your sim brief username, which you can simply do. And then you can go to the pilot support. Inside the pilot support, you've got the option to say, hey, give me the flight plan uh, from SimBrief, right? So currently I loaded this one, but if I would, would delete it, uh, and then I can press request flight from SimBrief. And then it will download it, including, I'd say, several options, right? It will tell you the uh, zero fuel weight, it will tell you the fuel, the payload, uh, the estimated en route option, the cost index, etc. Then you click on the export flight plan option. It will give a green marker here that says, hey, it's okay, we can continue. Next step, what you need to do is go back in the airplane and go to the init page. And in the init page, you've got the from and the to, right? So we're going to enter the uh, location. So KBFW, uh, then a forward slash, and then I will also need to have a look at it again. Uh, or it's K KBW India. <laughs> So error from my side. Uh, double checking again. So whiskey India. And then we're going to Kilo Oscar uh, Papa Foxtrot. And then we're going to say, hey, this is our airport. And then once you've done that, you can see that it comes up with, hey, this is the flight plan you have, right? So uh, this is the departing airport. Then we're going direct to uh, Scoop. Then direct to camper, direct to wet row, direct to chief, and then we're fl using airway uh, Yankee 291 to Saggy, and then still following that one to uh, Jordan, uh, Razal, Magic, etc. Right? And then ev eventually we will arrive at KOPF. If you're happy with it, then you can simply press insert, and then the flight plan will be inserted. So if you go inside this uh, flight plan itself by using the uh, flight plan option, you will see the flight plan. So in this video, we looked at how you can simply import the SimBrief uh, flight plan inside the A310 uh, using a workaround due to the fact that it looks like that the built-in, let's say, import mechanism might not work as expected. There are some people who are reporting it works, but I got it, uh, never got it working for some reason. I hope you liked this video. If you liked it, then consider to use the like button. If you've got questions or comments, then feel free to post them in the comment box below. And if you want to stay up to date about new videos I'm posting, then make sure that you're subscribing to my channel. Thanks for watching and see you next time.